Let's get this out of the way. Alex Ovechkin is the greatest playoff scorer of modern hockey. The numbers speak for themselves. During the most competitive time of the year, 44 even strength, 28 on the power play, for a total of 72 in 146 games. Good for a goal every other game. Here's a visualization of Ovechkin's dominance. Okay, I might have led you guys on. To all have higher goals per game averages. They just haven't been playing as long. With the exception of Gensel, all the players I just listed are centers. I want to talk about Ovechkin because he's used the right way. He's a right-handed shot, but he plays on the left wing. Even though this goal is ridiculous, you get an idea of why a winger should be playing on the wing opposite his shooting hand. Brad Marchand's also a left winger, but he's a left-handed shot. It's harder for him to come down the left side and get a good shot. Point A. He makes a move to the backhand and takes a low probability shot. The puck bounces off Calvin DeHaan and finds its way into the net. You could say that was luck, but you don't want luck in the playoffs. You want the few opportunities you have to score to have the highest percentage chance of going in. This is data I gathered from any playoff performer that has averaged over a point a game dating back to 2006 when the salary cap started. This is non-trivial. Wingers playing on their strong hand score at least 10 points less in all situations than a winger playing opposite the side of a strong hand. Put plainly, if you're a left-handed shot, you should be playing on the right wing, and if you're a right-handed shot, you should be playing on the left wing. This is especially true for left wingers. Right-handed shots playing on the left wing score 26 more points in even strength. On the power play, they score 25 more points. This is mostly due to the fact that most goalies are left-handed catching in the NHL. This makes perfect sense. When a puck is on the blade of a stick and it is directly in front of the net, it will see a bigger portion of the goal. Versus when you're carrying the puck closer to the boards, there is a sharper angle and so the puck sees less of the net. This is a sweet goal, but I still think it would have looked cooler if Ovechkin was coming down the left side.